area of holding all that weight and the structure keeping the entire thing together will collapse. This in turn leads to the appearance of a quark star, which is even smaller and denser than a neutron star. Now, let's say the pressure inside a quark star is getting stronger. As a result, things called strange quarks can appear in its core. They've been dubbed strange because, well, they don't behave like normal quarks. I would have gone with quirky quarks, but that's just me. Really simply put, if these strange quarks are numerous enough, they create strange matter, which is unique and unlike any matter you find on Earth. Oh yeah, and it could be the most dangerous thing in our universe. Hang on, I'm getting there. At first, let's conduct a virtual experiment with something more familiar than a new And start to squeeze it with tremendous force. Sooner or later, the atoms, neutrons, and protons will hard into the quark things. Add some more pressure, and some of these quarks will change, become heavier, and turn into strange quarks. What we have on our hands now isn't an iron atom, but something called a strange lift. That's a tiny piece of strange matter. Don't you just love science? Strange matter is heavier than our matter. Besides, our dear matter is organized and predictable. There are some atoms that are, in turn, made up of nuclei and electrons. And our quarks are neatly squeezed into neutrons and protons. Here's where the strange part comes in. Its quarks have no boundaries. They just truly run amok. Oh. Actually, call. 
called spaghettification, and it happens when something is stretched paper thin by a black hole's gravitational field. Everything that approaches a black hole gets broken down into individual atoms, and we become long thin pasta. Mm, that's the best way to go, I'm afraid. Yeah, it'd be a tough and dangerous feat to transport and throw this strange matter into a black hole. By the way, how do you transport it there anyway? You could probably use some kind of catapult, but that raises another question. sci-fi space travel scenario, it still seems impossible. In any case, at this point, strange matter is just a theory that hasn't been confirmed yet. Interesting enough, physicists have considered creating strange matter in a particle accelerator, kind of like the Large Hadron Collider. Luckily, they later came to the conclusion. Thank <laughs> you. 